right guys we are here making um what is the recipe called nana to die for carrot cake recipe we um nana got from pinterest all right so everybody is raving about this carrot cake so nana is going to show us how to do it and we're do double batching okay so nana so what do we have one and a quarter cups of unsweetened applesauce mm -hmm. which makes it two and a half cups okay two and a half cups applesauce and remember we're double batching two cups of granulated sugar so we have four cups. Oh wow, lots of sugar. Four cups. And then three eggs, room temperature. Mm -hmm. So we've got three eggs. One of them's a double yolker, so oh, I still wow. counted it as one. Okay. See, it's a little twin. <laughs> Blend this real quick. Okay. Here we go. Mix it well. Okay, mm -hmm. so we've got that. And then we add the second batch of ingredients, which is two cups of all-purpose flour, but again, doubling, so we're adding four. I certainly hope this all fits. So I'm going to just incorporate that a little bit, just so we don't get big fluff. We're going to add one teaspoon baking soda, one and a half teaspoons baking powder, and a half a teaspoon of salt, all in here. And I just mix it all together and double it. Okay. Oops. We are going to add four cups of grated carrot. Interesting. A cup of crushed pineapple. Oh. With the juice. Oh. That's what's going to make it really moist, too. And a teaspoon of vanilla. Mm. <laughs> oh boy. Nice and slow. Mm -hmm. Two batches, friends, is filled to the rim of the KitchenAid mixer. <laughs> that that's a lot. Okay, we're gonna transfer it to a bigger bowl because the last ingredient we need to add is the sweetened coconut. All right, we transferred it to a bigger bowl. Add two cups of coconut, sweetened it's flakes. Sweetened flakes. And two cups of chopped nuts. You can use walnuts or pecans. Mm -hmm. I like walnuts in a carrot cake. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. So if you guys notice with um, the batch, there's no oil or butter. Applesauce and moist carrots. There. Oh. All right. Transfer them into. Um, is this eight inch round? Those are nine inch. Nine inch round pans. You can use three eight inch or two nine inch. I only had nine inch. Mm -hmm. I think a triple layer is almost too big. Oh my gosh, I've got so much extra. Yeah. So here's more. And then, Nana, we're going to put them in the oven for, I believe, 25 minutes. 25 minutes. All right, here we go. This is the frosting for it. And, Nana, what does, um, what does it call for? It calls for one cup of softened butter, mm -hmm. 16 ounces of cream cheese mm -hmm. softened, and two teaspoons of vanilla and two pounds of powdered sugar. Okay, there we go. And that's working out just fine. And so we're just gonna turn this on until it's smooth and creamy. I mm -hmm. have to add a little more powdered sugar. Okay, and we're doubling the batch. So that's why it's looking a little bit messy because <laughs> we apparently need a bigger KitchenAid mixer, like three times the size. Here is okay. the cream cheese icing. It's all ready. We're just um, letting the 
cakes cool. Yeah. We're just letting the cakes cool. So the bigger cakes are being cooled. But um, she, Nana also made like a smaller cake version. And we're just going to let that cool. And then we're going to place the icing and then bring it to the party. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you guys for watching A Simply Simple Life. Mahalo. All right, here is the cake. Nana finished it up. She did some um, walnuts and um, sweetened coconut. Seems like she toasted it up, put it on top, and then she applied the icing, made it to the party. Extra icing. Extra icing. All right, here is Nana's carrot cake. So good. Yeah, look, it's